Hello viewers I'm sure you would have heard of the company Lockheed Martin which is an American aerospace arms defense information security and technology corporation and today we will focus in this video on Marilyn Hewson who is an American businesswoman and the strategic advisor to the CEO of aerospace and defense manufacturing company Lockheed Martin She had previously served as chairman, president and CEO from January 2013 to June 2020. She retired as an executive chairman and a board member in March 2021. Hewson was born on December 27, 1953 in Kansas, USA. She earned her Bachelor of Science degree in business administration and her Master's of Arts degree in economics from the University of Alabama. She also attended the Columbia Business School and Harvard Business School Executive Development programs. Hewson joined the Lockheed Corporation in 1983 after 4 years as an economist at the Bureau of Labor Statistics. She has held a variety of executive positions with the company including president and chief operating officer and executive vice president of Lockheed Martin's electronic system business area. Hewson became executive chairman of Lockheed Martin on June 15, 2020. Before that, she served as chairman, president, and CEO and led Lockheed Martin from 2013 to 2020 through a period of consistent financial performance and impressive growth. During her tenure as CEO, Lockheed's stock value increased more than 300%. In July 2015, Hewson announced Lockheed's purchase of Sikorsky Aircraft. the producer of the Sikorsky UH-60 Black Hawk helicopters giving Lockheed its helicopter building capability. Hewson also shifted more company efforts toward building military hardware. On March 16, 2020, Lockheed announced that Hewson would become the executive chairman of the board and be replaced as CEO on June 15 by James Tyslett. In 2010, 2011, 2012 and 2015 She was named by Fortune magazine as one of the 50 most powerful women in business. She was also adjudged CEO of the year for 2018 by Chief Executive magazine. Hewson is married to James R Hewson and lives in McLean, Virginia as of 2020. Her net worth is at least US dollars 112 million as of 22 February 2021. Now let us explore some business strategies adopted by this famous women entrepreneur. Strategy number 1: Establish your values and priorities. As soon as Hewson took over Lockheed Martin in 2013, she visited clients in the Pentagon and around the world to seek the feedback. They told her that the company didn't always listen well. Hewson made it a priority to crash this reputation. making customers relationship lockheed martin's primary focus this was of crucial importance as with budget pressures and the rising geopolitical tensions governments wanted to work with security companies they could trust strategy number 2 pivot when necessary when hewson first became the ceo of lockheed martin the majority of its contracts were with the us government unfortunately the pentagon was cutting back hewson quickly decided the company needed to expand its horizon and she set about growing international business she doubled the total share of overseas revenue over the next few years and towards the end of her stint as ceo spent around 40 to 50% of her time traveling strategy number 3 invest time in important things not only was the f35 one of the lockheed martin's biggest projects but it was also the department of defense largest program this means a great deal of scrutiny from all corners of government and media this also meant hewson invested a lot of her time in the project reviewing it overseeing production traveling to work sites leasing with customers and flying overseas to every roll out of the aircraft hewson has also consistently prioritizing digital transformation and is proud of lockheed martin's pioneering role in technology advancement strategy number 4 communicate with staff Maintaining channels of communication with 110,000 staff members may be a tricky business, but it's vital. She says that every business problem she ever faced where things went horribly. 
she would chalk up the miscommunication or the lack of communication listening and responding is what makes the difference in any business some people find it tedious to keep saying the same things over and over again i think you have got to do that you have got to constantly do that so that every employee of yours is aligned to the task at hand and goals sought to be achieved strategy number 5 huson's formula on leadership she summarizes that the most successful leaders regardless of their gender consistently demonstrate four fundamental traits trustworthiness compassion decisiveness and innovation leaders can earn trust by adopting open communication style demonstrating honesty showing vulnerability and acknowledging when they are wrong on decisiveness huson advocates that leaders must be able to make clear decisions even in the face of uncertainty and on being compassionate she says that people need to be treated as they would like to be treated what an inspiring personality marilyn huson is i hope you have gained through her career insights and business strategies presented in this video we have lots of similar stuff lined up for you so be on the lookout for the same and subscribe to our channel so that you do not miss updates we will be back soon thank you